grant thee my king. Tell me, Zanakis, have you ever gone fishing with your son? No, never. A soldier's life is all I've had the honor to know. <laughs> I would have liked to have gone fishing with my son. Spartans! Every breath that you have taken has led you to this moment. Every drop of blood, sweat, and tear, all of it has led to where you stand, right? Persians come to make slaves of us all. I have a better idea. I say we drench the gods with their blood! What say you, Spartans? For our sons! For our daughters! For Sparta! Yeah. <laughs> 
button. I'll bring Saxis your head. Xerxes sent his sheep to slaughter. Come, Persian! I will bring Xerxes your head, you insolent Spartan fool! Come and get it! We are betrayed, my king. Jerxes knows of the path behind the mountain. They are coming. <laughs> By dawn, you will be completely surrounded. We are Spartans. When are we not? Spartans. That word will mean nothing. Xerxes wipes your bloodline from the face of the Ew. Yeah, that's gross. Today was a day the Persians will never forget. Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. Finally. Wow, this is big, Layla. Did you really think it's the spear? This is the one. The book was almost right on top of it. I've never been so lucky in my life. Okay, let's start her up. Are you sure we can trust this thing? I mean, the book could be... Just start it, Victoria. You're the boss, boss. I'll prep it for you. Okay, so worth noting, I've made some changes since we're last in here. <laughs> There's no keeping up with the tech industry these days. I can crank up the simulation to maximum sensory synchronization if you're up for it. Um. I'm sorry, I just want to well, go Let's easy. take this one step at a time. Understood. If you're looking for something a little more intense, I can always adjust the settings for you later. This bit will let me know how much information will be fed to you during your time in the Animus. You don't need to worry about me. I've got this. A little autonomy never killed anyone. At least, I don't think so. Just let me know if you need assistance, and I can always add the helpers back in. Listen, Layla, before you go off, if this book is right, this fear, this story, 
It will change everything. You're putting a lot of faith in a fairly unreliable source. Historian or not, this guy wrote about magical objects and the will of the gods. He's not Homer. Irodotos was the first recorded historian, so there's a lot more truth in that text than you think. I mean, what better way is there of finding Isu artifacts than by trusting in the guy who claimed to meet an actual descendant? I know, but I need you to trust me. You could be right. This spear, this book, it could all be crap. But something tells me it isn't, and I'm certainly not gonna let Abstergo find out first. You're right. We haven't got much to lose anyway. There's just one small problem. What is it? This manuscript is in rough condition, to say the least. The DNA found on the spear has identified two different individuals. You're gonna have to pick which strand of DNA to pursue. The choice is yours. Okay, obviously we're going with Cassandra. She'll help us find what we're looking for. I have a good feeling about this. All right, boss. We're finally good to go. 431 BCE, here we come. The start of Peloponnesian War. Good luck in there. No pressure or anything, but we're all depending on you. Abstergo isn't gonna win this time. If what the book says is true and we do actually find the artifact, the assassins will finally have a chance to rise again. You can do it. Oh, and Victoria, read the book. It holds the secrets I won't be able to find on my own when I'm in there. Aye, aye, Captain. Get down here! Cyclops got a message for you. Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week! Wow, you bet. Laka! The Cyclops said you like to act tough, so act tough! Get a little closer, and I will. You should know by now. The Cyclops always collects his debts. You have a lesson to learn. If the Cyclops wants to teach me, tell him to come here himself. Never mess with the Cyclops! I'm not jumping this game. Ha! 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 
that's R1 and R2. Yeah, that makes sense. Last week? This shit happens every week. I can't keep doing this. Nah. Thanks for the warning. Oh, she... She is so hot. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. Nah. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Of course. Help yourself. Hungry too, Icarus? <laughs> Do you think Zeus would bless me with an ego like he blessed you, Cassandra? Maybe you could ask him for me. to put in a good word for you finally so what are you doing here oh I almost forgot Marcos is looking for you what does that weasel want now don't know he wants you to meet him at his new house on his vineyard what a vineyard Alaka. it's on the road to Sami he says wine will make him rich <laughs> Wine will make him rich. Since when has he had a vineyard? Yesterday, I think. So, Marcos, who owes me drachmi, is buying vineyards. With what money? I don't know. Where can I find Marcus's new beautiful estate? I you know the statue of Zeus on Mount Ainos? Care. It's south of that. Because this church sucks. Well, I guess I owe Marcos a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. <coughs> I'll go tell Marcos you're coming. My head. Fun's over. Tell that one-eyed freak if he ever sends you here again, I'm gonna cut out his other eye and feed it to my bird. Yeah, and feed it to my bird. I'll see Marcos as soon as I'm dressed. I'll have to go up top to get dressed. Oh, 
done. Yeah, where the hell is that? Am I supposed to go on foot? Do I not have a fucking horse? Whatever, I guess not. I could lose them. I guess not. Just this is the vineyard. Hmm. Straight ahead. Let's see what you've gotten yourself into this time, Marcos.
have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. Honestly, what, honestly, what am I doing? I just... Okay, just climbed up top, that's fine. Boss, I, I keep telling you, you, you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... <laughs> thank the gods. Phoebe found you in time. About grapes. I can still hear you. I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's beside the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Whatever. Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine? I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. That's not how that works. <laughs> is that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. All right. Then do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? Of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. Instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sami. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sami, my friend. Who's the merchant? Thuris. Oh you know Thuris. He's very nice.
Maurice. Again. Why do you keep lending him money? He's a loyal friend. I don't want his family to starve. You're a good friend, but you're bad with money. Where can I find the race? In a shop in Sami, overlooking the docks. You know this, Cassandra. Will he be there? You mistake me for the Pythia. I couldn't possibly know. How do you want to handle this one? Not like you handled that olive oil business. That was... Uh, that was too much. <sighs> I got the money. And now we'll never get any more from him. If you kill them all, nobody benefits. Threatening them and maybe more. Breaking things, certainly. Steal the money if you have to, but don't rob me of my customers. Unless you can't avoid it. These things happen. He'd better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. Of course he will. Oh, after, there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. It's too hot and too long a walk to go on foot. But... Think of it as interest, Marcos. Everybody benefits. Of course, my <laughs> I friend. Love this. You shall have your pick. It. Ah, you have picked a beauty, my friend. That horse is from Thessalonia, bred for its courage. Tell me about this one. The Skiros. You have an eye for sturdy stock, my friend. That horse can cling to mountain passes like a god. Huh. I like the look of the one on the right. Ah, the Macedonian. These are bred for battle. A true warrior's horse. Oh, sorry. I've made my choice. Which one will it be? The middle one. I'll take the one in the middle. Ah, uh, a, a fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. An unworthy horse. This Not is the one worthy. Are you sure? Because I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits, especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. Phobos. Remember, meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, F. Derby. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret. Not now, you fool. Fib has been taken. By what? who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Duris, Cassandra. Come on. But wait a second, what about right here? 
Let's go. Stand. <laughs> You don't look so good. I angered them, I think. The gods. It's possible. I hear they can be vengeful. I used to worship Hermes at the Drowarati cave. There are gods there too, you know. In the cave? They grant wishes if you bring them tribute. So everyone makes an offering and asks for something in return. Ah, no wishes of mine granted though. I'm running out of money and tribute. I'm poor myself, you know. I did something wrong. You know Hermes. He can be a trickster. Oh, but there are many gods in this cave. All asking for different things. Go hear him yourself. You'll get my last tribute if you do. I need to know if they're real. What do you think? What do you think, X? Should we... Should we go and do this or no? Alright. Alright. You got it. Don't worry. I'll go. Oh, thank you. Remember, be careful where you step, Mystios. You'll be walking on holy ground. We'll see about that. The Drogorati cave is... Okay, so we just gathered the iron without like any tools, cool.
Someone dropped offerings here. Looks like they were trying to carry them away behind the statue. Thank you. Let's go. Off we go now. <laughs> Bella. Okay. Oh fuck, get back there. Hop! Ha! There they are. I'll sneak up on them, I like it. Let's go. Let's ride. Off we go now. Come on. those ropes she'll make good ransom drachmi for the cyclops no one's gonna buy me from you they're all poor keep quiet phoebe <sighs> this tall grass will keep me hidden My like is get away.
Marcos is going to be next. Get them! Well, they're, they're, they're my fucking cover. You know what? I don't know what else. Time to get Phoebe out of here. How do you fucking jump? Are you all right? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since... Since my parents died? I'm okay. I've got you, and you've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? Oh, no. You'll have to be stronger than that! Don't give in! Let him have it! Got you! <laughs> Again! Up! Yes, Father. Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Ready or stop? Widen your stance. A soldier grounds themselves. Hmm? Good. Good. Uh. Approach me. Ah! That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> what are we eating tonight? Tonight we are having baby Alexios. <laughs> And what a feast he will be! No, not him! Take me instead! I'm tasty! Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Lay him in his bed. Yes, Pater. Cassandra. You are my greatest pride. Remember that. Oh. You will bring this family to glory. Go. Right. You worry too much. <laughs> you don't worry enough. We'll be all right if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. What'd they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos the mercenary? <sighs> Am I ever not in trouble? Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Here! Talos the Stone Fist has just what I need today. Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that.
Did that literally just say unidentified hand? Sami, the race will be at his shop. Got 
got a job to do, Cassandra? Shut the fuck up. Obviously. <gasps> Mighty Kefalus, I entreat you, send us a champion, someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. I'm the only one here, but maybe I can help you. <gasps> oh, Cassandra, you startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the Spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. If the spear is in the caves, I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. Kefalus had a spear? Cassandra, surely you've heard this story since you were a child. I didn't have much time for stories. Well, perhaps you didn't. But you know Kefalus founded Kefalonia and started the line of Odysseus. His spear was a gift from the gods. It was said never to miss its target. He must have hidden it in the caves after killing his wife with it. He threw a spear that wouldn't miss at his wife? He was hunting and heard her in the bushes. He thought she was a deer. It's a sad story. Sounds dangerous. Well, only if you throw it at someone. Why do you need a spear? Not thinking of becoming a soldier, are you? Of course not. But think how many people will come to the shrine if we have the Spear of Kefalus. With their donations, I could do so many things. Repair the sanctuary, feed the hungry families in Sami. So, where is this spear? Apparently, it's hidden deep in the caves beneath Kefalonia. There's an entrance north of here. Maybe you can try that way first. That's not much to go on. You have so little faith in the gods. If Kefalus means for us to have the spear, you will find it. I'll see what I can find. Oh, thank you. I'll prepare a spot in the sanctuary.
Got a job to do, Cassandra? Yeah, bitch. Hello, Luris. Business looks good. Tell Marcos to come down here himself, if he wants his money. Huh? Ah, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. You should have thought of that when you borrowed Drachmi, Luris. But my family... It's hot. I'm in a bad mood. And you are going to pay. We both know it. Now the question is, what do I break first? You? Or your merchandise? You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to... to... to a mercenary. Or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. You're right about that. Forget it, Rahmi. Marcos and I need to have a talk. You're letting me go? Then at least take this sword. Nothing special, but it's better Ooh. than that rusty one you've got. If the Cyclops involved, I'll need it. You better set Marcos straight or you're both dead. What can I show you? Let me know if you need anything else. running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. 
Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good, or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Cassandra, I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. You've made an idiotic promise, Marcos. One we can't keep. I thought you were invincible. Maybe I am, <laughs> but you're not. That is true. I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Cassandra! Uh, Alexios! Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh! Ha! You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! <coughs> <laughs> Kefalonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far... ...the streets to a Mistios with a Havel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you! How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Cassandra in on the details. She already has a plan to deal with these bandits.
She's the silent but deadly type. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Cassandra, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. Really? If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. These balls will make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? War's brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small-time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies. Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need a thrashing. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marco sure is lucky he's got you as his scapegoat. There's plenty of trees around. Why do you need this type of wood? I've been working on a new type of bow. It's more flexible, so it lasts longer, and can fire at greater range. Only a very special kind of wood that grows high in the mountains will do. Any idea where these bandits are? I'm not a tracker, I'm a boyer. They're in the mountains somewhere, that much I know. I'd check close to the lumber camps. I'll take care of the bandits. Make sure that you do, and be quick about it. I'll deal with these bandits and get you the wood you need as fast as I can. Have patience. It won't take long. Ha! <laughs> if you knew how long Marcos has been feeding me excuses, you wouldn't be saying that. All right, I did something for you, now you do something for me. Get my wood! I'm heading to bed. Good night, y'all.